I have neglected my backyard garden for about a week. I've been kind of busy, but I'm um, checking in on it now for the first time in about a week. And the dog fennel has certainly grown quite tall. It looks like the sunflowers might be peeking out. I think this is the first one to come out. And you can kind of see some wet patches from the automatic watering drip system, so that's working. And obviously, <clears throat> I have a lot of weeds that I need to clean up and I'm going to do them slowly and carefully so I don't exert myself. The tomato plant has really, really grown and I don't know if you can see that, but that is one big tomato sitting there. Now the onions are growing really well. Look at them all. I have to figure out if I can just pick these right off or if I can just pull the onions out because that's how ignorant I am about gardening. I've got a secondary tomato plant here, and I have to start putting up support for that. The littlest tomato plant is doing well. I gotta start putting up support for that too. Weeds, weeds, weeds. That pepper is starting to change color, which is exciting. I've got some more dog fennel that's kind of growing up there. And then these squash really seem to be doing okay. They're liking the automatic watering system. And I think I see, I don't know if I can catch it with this angle, but I think I see the first little, first little uh, squash down here. There it is. So it's happening. And then on that one there, I think there's some more. So kind of exciting to see this happen. The squash seem to be doing all right. More weeds and wildflower. Uh, getting a lot of these spiky plants. I tried pulling one up and almost yipped out in pain. And then I've got some more wildflowers, which are really thriving out here. Look at the wildflowers. So they are starting to come out. This is that mix. And uh, they are little teeny tiny wildflowers. And they're all just bundled up, growing and being happy with what looks like dog fennel. I don't really know even what this is. So obviously I have a lot to learn. Here's a purple, purple wildflower. There it is. So yeah, that's the garden. It looks like the automated drip system is doing well. And then back here in my corner of violets, sort of looks like they're dying down, which is kind of sad because this was like my favorite patch back here. But you know, that's the way things go. So pretty happy. I'll do some more work on this gradually and slowly and certainly not while the sun is out because I'm taking care of myself. And that's the pergola, which is wonderful to sit under and relax and feel good. Thank you. This has been my garden tour update. Bye.